As we rung in the new year, the farmers were out in the open, braving a cold winter on the borders of Delhi. The protesting farmers at Delhi's borders say that we'll only celebrate the new year when the farm laws are repealed. And the next round of talks between the government and the farmers will be held in the fourth. There's consensus on two issues, on the electricity amendment bill and on no penalties for stubble burning. But the demand for the repeal of the three farm laws continues to remain a sticking point. Arun Singh reports from the Singhu border. We have with us Majinder Singh Sirsa, who is a member of Shiromani Akali Dal. So my first question would be, are you here oh, politically, are you representing your political party or you are here from Gurdwara Committee? No, I am here as the president of Delhi Sikh Gurdwara Management Committee. Though in this agitation there are thousands and thousands of workers of every party, which includes Akali Dal also, but everybody is here as a farmer, mm -hmm. not as no representative to any political party. Okay. Now what is the response that you've been getting here? Since you represent a political party. See, from 27th onward, we are here from 27th. Okay. So, uh, I must say in last this 35, 36 years, there is 36 days, there is a lot of change. Earlier, there used to be a people who were staying here. Now, there are thousands and thousands of people who are visiting here. Hmm. Around maybe more than 50,000 people every day come from Punjab, from different areas of Punjab. Hmm. And equal number of people come from Delhi hmm. or the uh, NCR. So there is a huge support which uh, this Kisan movement is uh, getting here at Singhu border or Tikri or a, 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 the, the uh, East Delhi border. Hmm. So everywhere their numbers are increasing every day. So while the, these new farm ordinances were approved or were passed, there was an opposition that your party faced. Do you think there is a decrease in that now? No, but that was the reason that we stood by the farmers. We choose to when we have uh, tried to raise our voice inside the government hmm. that these bill will not be accepted by the farmers hmm. but the government was adamant to pass the bills okay. the moment sir, uh, had a mind and they put up these bills in a lok sabha we immediately withdraw our support from the party and also the 30 years old alliance we are no more member of nda so how do you see the way forward now how do I see? The way forward, what do you see? So, How, where do you see this ending? Do you see the impasse uh, coming close to uh, an end? So I think the government should have taken the stand by the time. So it's long protest now. And government is also well aware that these people are not wrong. Because they have convinced the government, have they have shown the mirror to the government, that your, the, the laws are not in the favor of farmers. In fact, they are more favorable to the uh, corporate houses. And government has also admitted that, okay, we are ready to amend the laws. But now the thing is the farmer wants it to be repealed, to scrap this laws. And I think it's a, a good opportunity for a government also that because farmers are saying we, we want that law should be there, but it should be with the uh, consent of the farmers and the stakeholders. No new law should be drafted and immediately implemented. So government should immediately repeal. The, that's what we can request from the farmer side also and from the Gurdwara side also.